Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody's having trouble welding letters together or words. So these are two identical Cooper Black fonts. I'm going to select both of them and I'm going to left click, no fill, right click, outline. And then you can take the shape tool and squeeze them together to get them closer together. So we're going to do that to both these. And then if one of your letters is off more than the other, you can take your shape tool and you can always click on that letter and then move it one way or the other to get a little bit more and click on the L and bring it in. Take the O, bring it in. So if you did that to both words and get them where they would weld together, then also if you would when you do that, if you would hold down your control button, it'll stay flat and then click off your control button. And you could also probably select both those at the same time and bring them over so they'd stay together. Now here's the difference. We're going to take this one and convert it to a curve. But it's still a text and it won't weld. So then we're going to break it apart control K. Now we're going to weld it and see what happens. It takes away the inner parts of the letter. Now that can be dealt with instead of going backwards. You can click on that inner part and nudge it up, nudge it up, weld, nudge them back. But here we're going to do a little opposite. We're going to take the letter. We're going to control K first. Then we're going to select everything and we're going to convert it to a curve. And then we're going to weld. It solves that problem. So if you convert it to curves first, before you break the text apart, you're going to have to do it this way. But if you break the text apart and then convert it to curves, it'll weld without that problem. And then both of them will smart fill to see what they look like. I hope that answers their question and thank you for watching.